Good morning, everybody. Welcome to day one of a three and a half month trip. Are you ready? <laughs> it's hot as hell here in Florida. Like sweat's just pouring off of us just from loading our bikes. I'm ready. So I'm ready. We're, we're ready to head out. We're gonna end up in Daytona tonight. We've decided to stay at a, at a beachfront place we stay when we go to Daytona. And we're like, we're just familiar with it. We know it's got a pool, it's on the beach. Might as well enjoy it, right? My so. Yeah, I cleaned your bike, Thank you. as usual. <laughs> Cleaned, maintained, and ready to go. But anywho, first things first, we've got to get uh, some video done, get some posting done, and get on the freaking road. Are you ready? I'm ready. Here we go. <laughs> All right, first things first. Got to see if it'll start. First gas stop. Something I'm going to try to do this trip is keep track of the fuel prices. So in Port Charlotte for 93 octane, it is four dollars and fifty-three cents. filled up we are 153 miles in and uh, we just filled up with gas we are in Vero Beach on A1A and gas here was $4.39 for 93 octane now Mama Badger is trying to find us a place to eat on the water any luck I'm starving yeah I think this actually might be a place that we went to with mom and dad at Mulligan's okay Mulligans it is. Sounds good. Here we go. Well, I do tend to change my mind, so. <laughs> right? So, let's go before she changes her damn mind. Let's eat. Okay, so sticking with Mama Badger's theme of things, the restaurant we were going to go to is Mulligans, which is over there. Instead, we're going over here to the Ocean Grill because, well, it's Mama Badger and she always changes her mind. But, I like to try new things. Look at that view. Look at that water. Looks fantastic. And we're going to be on the beach tonight. So I'm pretty excited. All right, let's go find some food. All right, guys, so we ate lunch in this cool place. Um, we had a burger and fries, but just check out how eclectic it is. Stained glass up there. Of course, it's hard to beat that view over there. But this place has some just eclecticness to it. See all the up there, all the stained glass, fishy stained glass. Check out this wall, it's pretty cool. Back toward the bathroom. There's a night. There's a place where you can get your loan. And then here's kind of like the main dining room area. Check out that chandelier. Lots of stained glass there. Sorry. And then there is a uh, a gift shop over there. We're ready for you now. Anywho, that's the place we ate. Pretty cool. Alright, and then here is the beach. Ooh, we're all fogged up. Try this again. There we go. Here's the beach. Everybody's hanging out, swimming, having a good time. All the way down the beach. We're gonna follow this A1A along this beach all the way to Daytona. We're about four hours away. 
it's pretty slow riding, but it's awesome when you're riding the, the beach. So we'll be there about five o'clock. On the road again, folks. Holy hell, my seat is hot. Well set on our seats and we'll be jumping back off of Welcome to Florida. Quick stop in Cocoa Beach. Why are we stopping? See all the holes in Mama Badger's jeans? They'll be all striped tomorrow because she didn't spray down her legs when she put on her sunscreen. So we're stopped so she could do that. I guess I can get some more water while I'm here. Sounds good. If we had more time, we might actually stop. So, it's raining right over there. It was pouring. So we decided to pull into a parking lot. And, uh... Have the weatherman look. Right. It'll be gone here in just a couple minutes. So a little sprinkle would not be bad because it's really hot. Which it's sprinkling on us now. But we didn't want to get poured on and be soaked either. So, we're waiting it out. It's, it's raining right now we're just under a tree see the tree mm -hmm. so anyway we'll hit the road here in just a second defog anyway. oh yeah we bought some defogger for the inside of her glasses to see if that'll help her in the rain Daytona Beach. Alright, we have arrived. We're in Daytona. We're at our Holiday Inn. We have a hell of a view. I'll show you guys later. But, we're going to run down to eat at the Racing's North Turn. Um, and then we're going to come back and put shorts on and go to the pool and the ocean and all that fun stuff. But first, food. Did you bring a towel? Um, I do have a towel. But... I'm not cleaning the bike again. Because our bikes are messy. Yeah, Already. so it rained just enough to get the to get the bikes dirty. What, four hours into the trip? Ridiculous. Alright, we're here at Racing's North Turn. If you guys watched us while we were here last um, Daytona Bike Week, we came here and ate. It's a great place to eat. It's got all this racing memorabilia in it. Really cool little restaurant, um, especially if you're into racing. And the food's really good. Okay. All right, y'all. Here's the view from the fourth turn. 
Another beautiful ocean view. Sit out here, enjoy the sea breeze, although it's really hot today. We're toast. We're gonna go get shorts on to go swimming. I'm ready for it. Yep, we're headed to the hotel for the night. We'll see you there. Alright, we're back. Here's that view I promised you. Bikes are parked down there. You can see them right there. That is the pool we're getting ready to head to. Shorts on, it's starting to cool off a little bit. And uh, now we're gonna play in the water. How high the tide is. People out there hanging out in the water. Having a good time. I'm gonna call day one a success. Tomorrow's a pretty easy day. Uh, we, I think we have like 200 miles to go from here to Jekyll Island, Georgia. We're gonna do a lot of like hopping on and off islands and stuff and do a little exploring since we have that time. And uh, it should be a really good trip. But that's it guys. That is a wrap for day number one of this epic adventure. Thanks for following along. Thanks for always liking, subscribing, commenting. We appreciate you all. And we will see you all tomorrow.